Hi, my name is Joseph Park, the WWE Champion of the World, and you're watching Sporting Icons. All right, so Derek Chisora versus Gerald Washington. This was the chief support to Anthony Joshua versus Robert Hellenius. Now, this was a 10-round fight. This was not a matrim paid fight. Derek Chisora was, of course, paid by his new employees, if you like, in Skill Challenge from Saudi Arabia, where he helps promote and whatever else. Now, this is a fight of the gatekeepers. I think it's fair to say that. Uh, both of them have been in there with some pretty good opposition. Derek Chisora more so, for sure. And um, if uh, all fighters were built of the same stuff like Derek Chisora, the heavyweight division would be very, 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 very healthy now, wouldn't it? But this was definitely an end-of-the-road kind of fight for both of these fighters. It has to be, doesn't it? Surely. But it was a fight that was somewhat predictable in the sense of you could see what both of them were trying to do. Derek Chisora was trying to jab away at the body and then go for the big bolo right hand over the top. And Gerald Washington was looking to go on the back foot and try and time him with an uppercut. That was pretty much the tail of the tape. Uh, for me, Derek Chisora won this one quite handedly, really. He was the one that was dictating the pace, the one putting on the pressure. Um, Joe Washington, listen, he had his moments. He was landing some pretty big shots. In fact, in round number two, um, Derek Chisora got a cut over the right eye. That was um, ruled as a head clash. It was. And Derek Chisora actually went down at the end of round two. It wasn't counted. The referee said um, it was a push, but it looked like a punch to me. Anyway, who knows? Who cares? Now... I think that this is the kind of fight that Derek Chisora should bow out on. Um, and I haven't seen the post-fight interview yet. I'm just waiting for it now. So maybe he's going to announce his retirement. I don't know. Obviously, um, he was wearing the baby pink, the Barbie pink, if you like, um, as his family, his daughters were there at uh, ringside tonight, which I don't really like to see for boxers because if you lose, you know, that's one thing. But then to have your kids there ringside, that's a little bit... It's hard on them, isn't it? But either way, either way, Derek Chisora, for me, easy win. Um, it's, um, it's quite a a sluggish fight. It's a, I mean, it's only a 10-rounder. Uh, both of them looked a little bit tired at times. Joe Washington looked more tired, which is strange considering that he was the one that wasn't really doing much other than moving away. Now, granted, he's a couple of years older than Derek Chisora. He's, what, 41 years old, something like that. So maybe that has something to do with it. Um, but is an interesting fight. Is an entertaining fight, that is for sure. For me, Derek Chisora won that fight. What do you all think? Do you think that is a bit closer? Do you think that maybe Derek Chisora maybe didn't win it? Do you think Derek Chisora should carry on? Drop your thoughts below. Click on that subscribe. Catch you next video.